Are we gonna scrape or not? Probably. Today we're actually going to be leaving and also I feel like we're going to be doing a lot of stuff. Because <laughs> you guys saw we had the beer Z over at the Airbnb. This team actually ended yesterday so we had to stay tonight over here. This driveway is freaking brutal. I already hit my lip getting in it last night at, on that big freaking whatever that is right there. Already scratched my carbon lip up and everything. But yeah, you made it out this morning. Oh snap, we got a tunnel. Oh my god, dude, it's so loud. I don't think you're gonna finish that. That's a lot. These are huge. 10 out of 10. How do you like the food? I think it's really good. Bomb. They're huge. The They're bigger than my point. face. I know you Vegas people, if you guys haven't gone to a mirror brunch, you know, we're probably pro. Everybody knows about that place. <laughs> He dead ass wants to impound my car because of my front windshield tent. And he's like, You're either gonna tow it, or we're gonna tow it, you're gonna get it towed, or you take off the tent right now. And I'm like, It's gonna take a while. 
Do I have to do it here or do it, can I yeah. take it somewhere? You need it right here. Take it off. It'll be a while. I'm just, I mean. We'll start see how the process goes. Are you still going to call the tow truck or? I haven't called it yet, no. So we're good after that. If I take the tent shield. Yeah, I can let you off. drive. You said you got an airbag for it somewhere. I don't have it on me. It's on my other steering wheel. How do you switch the electronics on that? Yeah, I mean, it's easy. Just, I just it? don't have all the parts. Cause Where's we're, that at? It's at my house. I In dropped California? all the California? Yeah. Yeah, I'll let you go if you take the tent off. He said if I take the tent off right now, he can let me go. Like, it's such an inconvenience. Like, he just says my car is too unsafe. He's just being like... And he's like, where's your airbag? This and that. I'm like, I don't... The good thing is that at least he's not bringing up the tow thing again. This is so bad. Oh my god. All right, so as you guys saw, we got freaking pulled over in the BRZ on the strip. I was not expecting it whatsoever. But right here on the ticket, he got me for his entire windshield covered in tint. Also removed driver's airbag as well as removed license plates. So those three, just because of my quick release steering wheel, the front windshield tint, and then the no plate. So at the show, I was running the wrap vault little license plate cover. Uh, just because it looks much more cleaner than obviously the license plate. I didn't even have a screwdriver, so that's why I didn't change it to my license plate. They are fixing tickets, which is good. Could have been way worse, to be honest. Yeah, he was threatening me to literally impound the car. Um, he was telling me to like either tow it myself, take the windshield tint off, or that they will like freaking impound it, uh, which is crazy. So as you guys saw, um, he let me go, you know, with a fix it ticket under one circumstance, which was to take off the front windshield tint. <laughs> this is it right here, literally my entire windshield tint. Dude, that's crazy. Luckily, luckily it was new, so it wasn't hard to take off. Um, but we're definitely gonna have to retint that because I cannot stand no windshield front tint. It just looks much more aggressive with it on. It could have been way worse. Like I couldn't imagine getting the car impounded because that was literally our only way home. The plan all along was to drive the car back to San Diego, which is about like five hours away because um, the flights were super, super expensive. So I don't know what would have happened if I got the car impounded. Um, I probably would have had to like book a last minute flight and then I would have to come back to Vegas because the car would be stuck here in the impound lot. So I was like, you know what? I'll just sacrifice the windshield tint. Um, I'm just glad he ended up working with me on that because like that would have been a complete nightmare. And I posted up like a little pop of me tonight. So like if we got the car taken away, that just would have not worked out. So we still have the car, which is good. Just no front windshield tint. All right, so last minute, we kind of did a little pop of me in Vegas. We got the BRZ out. Guys, this is the freaking throttle BRZ winner. That's freaking crazy. The purple one that they did, that's the owner right there. That's so freaking sick. How does it feel, dude? Dude, it's insane. It probably doesn't feel real, huh? Like still? It, it still doesn't. It just changed my whole life. That's a dude, the car. that's so dope. Got to meet you, got to meet the guys, <laughs> got to meet him. How do you say the Adro? The Adro kit, yeah. And okay. it's basically black at night, but it's a midnight it's green a, color. Yeah, it's a green. I like the carbon too. I want to do that for the trunk. Uh, tiny bot. This carbon. is a 5D one, huh? Yeah, so uh, 60. 60? Yeah. Up and down, and then this is all real carbon, so don't bunk me. I'm and the hood. Oh, the hood is real carbon. We changed it. <laughs> See, I got real carbon, so don't bunk me for that. That's so sick, man. I like your sweater, bro. What's up, dude? Okay, sure. We got the hoodie right here. Let's What's go. up, bro? Damn, we got the merch. We're in the shirt underneath too, you know. He's got well. the. Oh, sh really? Yeah, I'm wearing the same. Oh underneath. shoot, pretty good turnout so far. Honestly, this was like a very last minute thing, so I was not expecting it to be something crazy. But dude, a lot of people actually came through. Got a wide variety of stuff. Dude, this is so freaking sick. I don't have the balls to do that to my STI, to be honest. <laughs> you guys think big camber on the STI? Jeez. All right, first time signing the helmet. For real? Yeah, go, go, go all out, bro. <laughs> Alright, there you go. <laughs> Appreciate you, bro. Thank you. Got more people coming through. Look at this one. The underglow. <laughs> yes, Spam Subi. Hard. Classic red and white combo. Oh. I love that. Reminds me of the WRX. Yeah. <laughs> that is so freaking sick. Two hours, is it? Yeah.
The details, bro. That looks so good. The bro. STI and the VR. <laughs> That's the FRS sick. Too, but I forgot. <laughs> Appreciate you, man. Thank you. I like this. This is super, super sick. Heck yeah, with the clear toms, dude, it goes so well with the freaking silver. All for real went crazy. I was not expecting this meet to really get any traction, but. Yo, it's a good amount of cars. Some people have left, but like. Last minute thing, dude, this is freaking sick. Chevron, I think it's in the country, something biggest Chevron, I don't know. But it's like a hundred pumps, literally. Look at it. It just goes down, that's crazy. Ooh. The Rolls Royce. Guys, look how freaking sick this is. <laughs> Pump 87. This thing just goes on for so long. It's something like the world, I think it's like the country's biggest Chevron, I don't know, something like that. I'm gonna have to research it, but BRZ looks so freaking good. And uh, this is pretty much the start of our five hour road trip back home. I think we're good to go. This is how the BRZ looks. We're literally gonna drive it back. All this camber, stretch tires and everything, but it should be good. We did that little pop-up meet, which is so freaking sick. It was nice meeting all you guys at the little meet we hosted. And um, I wanted to host it because I know not a lot of you guys were able to attend SEMA, so I guess it was cool for you guys to see the BRZ in person while I was out here. But um, yeah, I need to get a coffee real quick. Guys, I've been hooked. I mean, literally hooked on this stuff recently. It is so freaking good. Like, I don't even need coffee sometimes, and I just like just because of taste. This should be good though. Two is plenty. Uh, no. Oh, it's gonna be All right, that pretty much concludes our trip in Vegas. Went ahead and went back to San Diego, which is about a five hour drive back home. Stopped to get gas in a little, and then unfortunately found out my shark fin antenna actually fell off on the freeway. I forgot to bolt it in. Yeah, this is a crazy one. Was not expecting this whatsoever, uh, but I appreciate all you guys watching this video. Also super thankful for all the love and support you guys have been showing me on the reveal of the purple BRZ. See, it's been a hectic, past month or so, um, you know, getting this car ready for SEMA and the whole Vegas thing. But we're finally back at home and um, we got some STI content coming very soon. With that being said, hope you all have a good one today. Make it a good one and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.